I go by the name Abdirzak Abdullah Umar. I'm a bona fide Garissa resident. I want to add my opinion on the current issues of protest, pro, protesters, the Gen Z team, the current affairs of this nation, Kenya. As I have said, it's a constitutional right to protest. It's, it, is, it has been maintained in the constitution of this country. Somebody or a community or a group can protest to go against the wish of the, of the government. For now, the finance bill. Having said that, I want to weigh the issue of the current DBT president, Honorable Rigadi Gashagwa, that he has gone out of way time and again, not for the first time, not for the second time, and still continue. The kind of hatred that he harbors in his heart is out of this world. Right now, we, have, we, came, we came from an election, a very competitive election that lasted in the 2022 August. And we know the pattern, the political pattern of this country. Rigadi Gashagua belongs to the Kenya, Kenya Kwanza team. Now that the current government, the Kenya Kwanza, he is the co-worker of the president. Now, on this issue of finance bill, it came on this time where the Kenyans are overtaxed. That is going on in the current uh, the, the Kenyan parliament. Regarding Gashagua, in his mind, he has gone out of that. He has started to sponsor the, 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 the demonstrations that's going on in this country, specifically in Nairobi. Why am I saying that? I am saying that because yesterday he himself, he has declared that he's the one who was sponsoring. He is the one who has called off the, the demonstrations. And he has gone out of his way to talk ill about NIS, Nurdin Haji. Bona, Bona Gashagwa, we respect you a lot. But now, the way you are speaking, you have destroyed that relationship that we had initially with the office. You came to us in Garissa, the recent flooding and the other time of drought. We thought you are one of us. We thought you care about us. We thought you are together in this journey. But recently you have turned the other way around. Buana Nurdin Haji is a man of high caliber. He had been holding offices. He had been all, all holding the deputy uh, uh, NSI, NSIS. He has been promoted to be the DPP. Now he is holding the DG NIS. He had gone all the procedural way of employing a Kenyan. He was, he was interviewed by a high caliber interviewees. He was appointed by the highest office in this region. That is the president. If he had any issues in his papers or his conduct or the way he handles matters, he wouldn't have been the, the current DG in this country. Bona DG, Bona, Bona DP, Deputy President, you are the one who has, do, who has gone down in the, in, in the ladder. 
you were the deputy president of this nation, but now you are the deputy president in one region, that is the central part of this country. You are the president of Nyeri, you are the president of Kiambu. But the people of central Kenya, Wamekukata, you are only going around with one or two members of parliament. The rest of the Kenya Kwanza team that come from the central part of this nation are with the President William Samoy Ruto. If you have a good intention, why are the people who come from the, from the central are going against you? If you have a good intention, why are you always moving around in one region of this country? If you, are, you have a good intention, why is your office allocated 1.2 billion when you know that the other part of this country we are suffering when it comes to drought? There are people who are suffering with the, with the, with the militia in the, in the Rift Valley. There are people who are suffering. The students are not going to school. There are, people are not fed in the, you know, in, the, in the institutions. That is the primary the ECDs, but your office has been allocated 1.2 billion. You have not came out to say that you don't deserve that because of the issues that are, that are going around in this country. But now we know who you are. You are the wolves in this, in this region, in this nation. You don't deserve that office. If it's a matter of resignation, if it's a matter of apology, if it's a matter of what, you are the person who is supposed to do that. Because Kenyans wamekujua sasa wezi jificha tena. Bwana Gashagwa, kumbe umekua one term MP. You have been promoted from an MP to a deputy president. You don't deserve that position. Always defanya kazi. After this, we know who to elect. We know who to support. What we are Central, they, those are our people. They are living with us in Garissa. They are living with us in Mandera. They are living with us in, in Moyale and any other part of this, in this country. Lakini wewe ile chuki kwanayo kwa hiyo roho, itakusumbua. I want to tell you that. Nurdin Haji is not going anywhere. He is there to maintain his position.